IACD is really a network of people doing community development work globally. And it's a really dynamic group, so we can really share experiences, we host events, we have learning exchanges so that people can travel to a different community to see how they do things and learn from them. It provides opportunities for people like me who work in uh, mainly urban northern Britain to network with people working in very different contexts. So it's about people doing work at the local level but thinking in terms of global context. It is not a very highly bureaucratic network that is so much uh, controlled through monies and donors, but it is a simple network that it, it connects people together who share a common purpose that is for the good of, uh, of, of the world. detach ourselves from uh, top-down uh, development initiatives uh, imposed by either governments, uh, business or big international development agencies and we put um, the community at the center of community development and the community is the main route uh, for development. IOCD aims to address social justice issues like poverty, like discrimination, social exclusion, inequalities through using community development and we aim to influence policymakers. I also found that uh, the, 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 the level at which individuals contribute to ISCD and to the values and principles of ISCD really which focus on, uh, on, uh, on the aspirations of the, the, the disadvantaged people who have a voiceless. When I when we're talking about something that's happening in community development or in social justice in the world, I have my perspective, my Canadian perspective, but I also get to hear from my IACD colleagues, so I get a uh, Ugandan perspective, an Indian perspective, a Pakistani perspective, an Australian perspective, a Scottish perspective, a US perspective. Um, so I get to see the world becomes bigger for me and I get to see it through more eyes. The reason is to give them access to community development information and support services and influence and it will also help them to bring uh, it also help uh, to bring local people together it's really important to have uh, a diversity of people involved in the dialogue around community development particularly at this time when we hear so much about the impact of globalisation and the financial crisis. But with IACD, I find that we, our common base is that we're working more for the common good universally and so we're interested in whatever's happening and whatever people are trying to um, change for the better of their society. There are so many opportunities to get involved which run all the way from your own backyard to the front door of the UN in New York. Um, so whether you're interested in international study visits, um, exchanges, inspiring policy or research, this is a platform where you can really connect the, the local to the global. ISD is a kind of network uh, that uh, provides an opportunity to interact at global level. So when a new member intends to interact uh, with any part of the world and uh, want to understand the issues and uh, the specific, uh, specific issues of their area. Local communities are increasingly affected by global events and global institutions. IECD has a key role to play in building solidarity and action among community development workers across the globe. Everyone will take away from a network like IACD different things and like any other community development organisation you'll get out of it as much as you put into it. We also endeavour to secure bursaries um, so that members can actually come together face to face and this has enabled members from as far afield as Uganda and India to work together in Australia. Um, we also have a monthly e-bulletin and a quarterly newsletter 
that means you can actually stay connected and get involved from your current location. These are all the ways that you can get involved. As I say, it's as simple as visiting iacdglobal.org. Um, do that and hopefully we'll be chatting soon.